for relative motion problems where the velocity of A and the velocity of B are in straight lines and both given, we can find the velocity of A relative to B or even the velocity of B relative to A straightforward, just a direct substitution. And the same thing also if we have the acceleration of A and B also in straight lines. And here is another example where VA and VB are both given as magnitude and directions. VB has two components in the I and in the negative J. VB has a component in the positive I. So if we add these components together and we collect the I and J components, then we can find the magnitude and we can also find the direction. But how about finding the acceleration of A relative to B? In this case, I need the magnitude and direction of both accelerations, A and B. Let's say that B is slowing down. So it will have an acceleration in the negative I direction. And let's say that car A is increasing its speed. In this case, A will have a positive tangential acceleration in this direction and also a positive normal acceleration in this direction. And both components, the tangential A and the normal A, each one of them will have two components. The tangential A will have two components, one in the I and one in the negative J. And the normal acceleration here will have a negative I component and a negative J component. So the acceleration of A will have four components and the acceleration of B will have only one component and we need to add them all together and use the same thing as we did here in the velocity to find the magnitude and the direction. Thank you.